All right. So, uh, as I planned for my vlog, I have this announcement that we are. Um, we we are replacing Otis with a new program called uh. How do you pronounce this? I I don't know. Um. Boat Operations, a tutorial in sailing. Because, um, I don't know. I kind of felt like it. So... You know, we, we kind of decided the math is for um, nerds who have no connection with nature, and it, it would be... You know, it would be a better life experience if we took all the people who were solving math problems uh, at a desk and um, helped them, you know, reconnect with Mother Nature by sailing out in the water. And so, um, you know, why sailing instead of that? It is a more active and physical experience. No, you don't. You don't need to touch grass. Water is better than grass. All right, like. You can have grass without water. Um, sorry, what, what, what did I say? Grass depends on water, so the the water is more important. This is what I'm trying to say. All right. Um, where? Yeah. Um, you know, you can experience the beauty of nature, stay active and fit, and so on. Um, this program will start on. June 3rd, 2023, where we will be departing from Seattle, Washington. And um, we're going to take the boat straight to Japan. And the timing works out really well for this because um, it takes about like 30-ish 30, 30 days, get plus or minus, to sail across the Pacific Ocean, according to the... Um, according to Google or something. I don't know. And so, you know, even if you are a... Uh, you, you are one of the math nerds watching the stream, and you qualify for the IMO team. You will, um, with with some error bars, you will arrive at Japan literally just in time for the International Math Olympiad, and everything is going to work really well. And you know, it's a great opportunity to pick up a lot of really quote unquote useful skills, like um, you know, whatever whatever the list here says, right? Like you can. Um, you can navigate the ocean, learn a lot of very practical skills like how to tie these very elaborate knots and put up like cells and things. Um, learn how to deal with actual weather, like you know, maybe there will actually be storms on the voyage or something. And um, blah blah blah, you know, environmental awareness, all, all these super great things. And so, yeah, you're going to learn a lot of stuff that you can't learn from doing math problems. And most importantly of all, um, no college application officer is going to be able to call you uh, yet another textualist math grind ever again because you literally sailed across the Pacific Ocean in a boat over 30 days. It's something like almost no one else that is applying to college is going to be able to say they have done. So, you know, this is how you can stand up. Um, so, yeah, um, this will be the replacement for year 9 of Otis. We're going to we're going to just sail a boat. Instead. Um, yeah, so um, at term application goes, links at the bottom of the blog post. Um, you can either complete an international selling license or you can be a ma member of the International Maritime Organization. Um, yeah, I think e either of those is fine. Um, or also like, I don't know, probably a lot of other things are fine too. So whatever. Yeah, so apply today. You can pad your college application <laughs> with something that like literally no one else will have. In addition to whatever math credentials you have, it'll be great. Um, apply today. Thank you uh, for listening to this advertisement. Um, yeah. Do Otis alumni Odo qual for bonus? No, sorry. <laughs>